Freddie Gillespie is a 23-year-old big man for the Toronto Raptors. After signing two 10-day contracts, him and the Raptors organization signed a two-year NBA contract, according to Sean Serenia and Blake Murphy of The Athletic. The six foot nine big man recently got his opportunity with the Raptors, showcasing his athletic ability and infectious personality through multiple hilarious post-game interviews and even a video of him singing Party in the USA with Malachi Flynn in front of the Raptors team. It's safe to say that he's had an enormous impact on the Raptors organization, but how did he get here? Today I'm going to walk you through one of the most touching underdog stories I've ever seen. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe for more amazing content like this. The place is St. Paul, Minnesota, and Freddie Gillespie is in 8th grade. Up to this point, he never played basketball in his life. He grew up primarily playing football, and in grade 9 at 5'11", he decided to try out for the East Ridge High School basketball team, where he would break his ankle on the first day of tryouts for the freshman team. He grew to be six foot four by the time he was a sophomore and played on the junior varsity team. Unfortunately, he would tear his ACL as a junior and would be done for the season. And at such a young age, this kind of injury is a significant setback. Though not having the same athletic bounce as before, he would play his senior year in high school and attend Carleton College, which was a D3 college after getting zero D1 or D2 scholarship offers. He primarily chose this school because of its academic prowess, but he was considered to be the most athletic big man in the entire conference. He only played 16 total minutes as a freshman, and as a sophomore, he was able to get more reps, averaging 10 points per game, 8.3 rebounds per game, and over 2.5 blocks per game on 53% shooting from the field. After his sophomore year, he decided to transfer to a D1 college, where luckily because of a family friend, he was able to apart and become a member of the Baylor basketball team as a walk-on in his junior year. As a redshirt junior, he averaged 5.3 points and 4.4 rebounds per game in 26 games played. On December 9th, 2019, Gillespie was named to Big 12 Player of the Week after contributing 17 points, 13 rebounds, and 5 blocks in a win over Arizona. At the conclusion of the regular season, Gillespie was named Big 12 Most Improved Player, Second Team All Big 12, and to the All Defensive Team averaging 9.6 points, 9 rebounds, and 2.2 blocks per game. In the 2020 NBA Draft, he went undrafted, and later was cut from the Dallas Mavericks during training camp earlier this season. On January 11, 2021, the Memphis Hustle selected Gillespie with the second pick overall in the 2020-2021 G League draft. In 15 games, he averaged 10.5 points, 10.5 rebounds, and nearly 2.5 blocks in 28 minutes per game while shooting 57% from the field and recording 6 total double-doubles. On April 8th of 2021, Gillespie signed a 10-day contract with the Toronto Raptors. Two days later, he made his debut, recording 6 points, 4 rebounds, 1 assist, 3 steals, and a block in just 18 minutes in a 135-115 win over the Cleveland Cavaliers. On April 18th, he signed his second-day contract with the Raptors and tied his career high with 10 points, 2 rebounds, 1 assist, and 1 steal, going a perfect 4-4 from the field in a 112-112. 106 win against the Oklahoma City Thunder. And today, Gillespie signed for the remainder of the season. He is currently considered to be one of the bright young players on the Raptors roster at just 23 years old and has addressed a need for them along with Kembert as a rebounding rim runner who can also protect the rim on the other end of the floor. Freddie Gillespie has overcome a lot to get here and he will continue to serve an important purpose for the Raptors the rest of the season.